Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how to enable the secure folder in your Samsung mobile. To do this, open the secure folder first. To enable the secure folder, what you have to do is open the notification panel and here you can see the secure folder option. Just enable it. Now it pop ups like this. Click on continue. Now it takes some time to create a secure folder. Initially, it takes time. After that, you don't need to worry about it. It's just like unlocking the mobile. You unlock the secure folder. I already uploaded a video regarding how to remove or uninstall the secure folder from Samsung mobile. If in case you wanted that, you can check out that video in the iCards or in the description or at the last, I mean the end of this video. So after that, it will ask you, you add any pin, password, pattern or any fingerprint or even if you want, you can reset the password of the secure folder with the help of your Samsung account. Now a option is pop up that you turn on the reset with Samsung account. That means if you forgot how to unlock the secure folder, you can reset uh, the secure folder lock with the help of your Samsung account. But only if you turn on this option, then only it works. Otherwise it won't. So I suggest you, you turn on this feature. So it really helps you a lot. If in case your mobile is used by different persons, then don't turn it on. Only you know the password of the secure folder. In my case, I'm the only person using this one. So I'm turning on this. Now click on next. That's all. Now your secure folder is created. If in case you want to add the accounts like the Google account or Samsung account, click on the three dots on the top right corner, then go to settings. Now click on manage accounts. From here, you can add multiple accounts as you want it. Now I'll show you how to change the secure folder icon. To do this, select the three dots on the top right corner, then click on customize. Now you can change the app icon, app color, or even the name also for your convenience. You can't add any image or any alternative thing to it. These are like default icons are available and colors are also default. After that, you click on apply. Now changes are applied. You can see the secure folder now. If in case you want to hide the secure folder from your app list, open the notification panel and select the secure folder once. Now it turned off automatically. If in case you want, again, you enable the secure folder icon on the notification panel, this is added to the app list. So this is how you can create the secure folder in your Samsung mobile.